What's up everybody? I wanted to do a review on some shoes that I picked up from Walmart recently. These are the An One Capitals uh, 3.0 and they sell at Walmart for $14.97. So the reason why I purchased these is because I think they look pretty nice. They look like a Jordan. I'm not really familiar with the, the number Jordan to be exact but it does look like the Jordan to me slightly um, I would never personally spend that kind of money on a pair of Jordans but for $14.97 you can't really get you know too upset about it so I love the colorway that black gray look gray on the tongue nice logo I like this mesh kind of feel right here the inside the upper part of it does have some stitching in it you see they have like that elephant print going around the toe box area and partially back here I like that they have a pull tab so it's easier to put on your shoe inside of the shoe is a removable uh, insole and I have taken out the insole and the other sneaker and this is what it looks like I have worn these I bought these actually back in the summer and I wanted to wear them so I can give a little bit more insight on what these sneakers were like so the insole is very simplistic but it adds just enough cushion in the heel so you don't have to worry about foot fatigue and if you really need to uh, Walmart does have um, an extra insole that you can get I believe for like a dollar ninety seven in the um, pharmacy area you can go get you get you some and it's like maybe like that then but it adds even more cushion to something that's already nicely padded so if you want to do something like that you can do that I just think that's really cool that they added that option because there are a lot of high-end sneakers that do not have a removable insole so back to the shoe so just to, to start it off, I did not play basketball in this shoe. I don't play basketball, so I can't really give you any idea of how they would perform as basketball sneakers if they would do everything that you would want them to do. But overall, just wearing them casually, going to the store, walking in them for about seven to eight hours, they've held up pretty nicely. And what I like about these sneakers is that they were easy to break in. I didn't have a point in time where my feet were just in pain from wearing these. The moment I slipped these on my feet, they were extremely comfortable. What I like about it is even though the silhouette kind of reminds me of a Jordan, to me they kind of fit like an old school skate shoe. So I like that about it. I've had these shoes since about July, mid-July, and here it is Halloween, and the shoes are still holding up fine. There is a stigma with, you know, Walmart sneakers not holding up well. Let me grab the other one. Walmart sneakers not holding up well and uh, falling apart. These shoes come in two different colorways. You have this one. And then you have, I call it the Chicago colorway. It's red, black, and gray with a little hint of white. Overall, is the shoe worth $14.97? I would say so. It is worth $14.97. If you are someone that does not intend to use this shoe to play sports in, or even if you wanted to, you could test it out and see how they perform for you. I mean, it's $14. Bucks. Um, you can't really lose with that if you decided to get these to test these out in performance see how they perform if you decided to take them to the gym I think that they would honestly hold up well if you decided to wear them to work out in um, or if you just decided to wear them just for everyday use they are decent they are decent shoes they are good um, I do have a pair of uh, curries that I wanted to show you guys and just compare the differences of them so these are my curries. I hardly ever wore them because I didn't like them actually. I got them for my birthday and I just didn't care 
for the tow box and they were uncomfortable. They do not have a removable insole and they are narrow right here where this gives you enough room in the toe box compared to these where it seems like the toes kind of cramped together and they seem to run smaller than these these are solid size 13 where these seem like they're more of a 12 and a half and not exactly a 13 material wise comparing the two I mean these hands down feel better material wise they feel like they're going to hold up better compared to these where you can tell this is all um, low end man made type of material and it might not hold up that well things that I did not like about this sneaker I didn't like the fact that if you don't wear um mid to high socks in these this piece right here will cave into the back of your ankle and it will irritate it something furious so my recommendation is to get socks that go above this notch back here so you don't have to worry about any kind of irritation would I buy these sneakers again for $14.97 it's not a bad sneaker at all it's not a bad sneaker it does everything that it needs to do it has an amazing amount of comfort for the price range the grip is good I haven't had any problems with the grip I love the design of them I would say yes I would buy them again I would get them again I think these are perfect for people who just want some basketball shoes but don't want to spend the money or people who are just going to use them for casual casual use or people who have kids and they don't want to buy them shoes that they're just going to wreck in a matter of days you just get them something like this and i just think they're they're good they're good sneakers to get and you know don't just look at the price range look at what it can actually uh give you and i've had these like i said since july and here it is halloween and these things are still going on strong no soul is like falling from falling apart the rubber is still great at the bottom the comfort is still there they still look clean they're they're a decent sneaker so i would definitely recommend going to go get these now as for basketball like i said i cannot tell you to go purchase it if you have basketball practice coming up i don't know how they will hold up for something like that you would need to buy them and see see how they hold up so, if you like this video, make sure to thumbs it up, and we out.